Hello friends. It is finally here. It feels like it took forever. But it seems also that this uh, DHL, like all the other shipping companies, because of the coronavirus, they have some transportation difficulties. So it seems uh, to be, looks like it's very well packed. We have here the new Okitel WP6. I'll move the camera a bit here so that you can see the unboxing. So, very nice well, and well packed. Uh, with this warranty certificate now it's instructions yeah. this is the warranty certificate an OTG cable it looks like it is not type C hmm. That's quite unfortunate. It's just a normal USB, micro USB, and the charging brick, which has so it says output 2000 milliamp hour. Four five. Uh, actually, it has two thousand milliamp hour for five, seven, and nine volts. And here it is, the Okitel WP six. Oh, and here it is also the key, so it seems like looks like I have to use the key. And we will see that later. Let's put this one over here. So this uh, Okitel WP6, I bought it in Gearbest. As I said at the beginning of the video, it feels like it took forever to arrive here because of the coronavirus. But I'm happy it arrived anyway. So, yeah, alright, so let's start with uh, this as a bare screen. Uh, it's an Better screen than uh, K10,000 Max, which I have it over here. Let me power it up. So, as you can see, this one has the W uh, K10,000 has 5.5 inch screen. And the WP6 has 6.5. Do not recall exactly, but I can tell you. All right, so it this phone has a MediaTek Helio P70. Has a CPU, which says an ARM Cortex 
quad core so four cores are a73 and another four cores are a53 also has a GPU of three cores are Mali G72 a RAM of 6 gigabytes 1600 megahertz a storage of 128 gigabytes memory card micro SD micro SD HC and yeah so the display it's 6.3 inch IPS 1080 by 2340 on um, 24 bits and one of the the best features it's a uh, 10,000 milliamp power that's why it's quite heavy it's a little polymer battery Android 9.0 Pi and yeah the camera has 48 megapixel uh, the camera in the back and in the front it says 1920 by 1080 pixels and also in the back it has 30 frames per second yeah all right um, so i think that's it uh, it has a bluetooth 5.0 it says type c but as far as i saw it here it definitely not type c this is not type c this one it's not it says uh, in the specs but they didn't introduce it so yeah I set up uh, the phone before so if you see it over here uh, let me see like this ah, wait okay, can make it it's quite fast though yes all right so uh, let's uh, present the phone has a small notch over here on the top it's a water drop notch uh, 6.3 inch screen uh, on the top has nothing but I think yeah it's it's nothing over here on the left side it is the sim card tray which uh, I presume you can open with your finger yeah but you still need the the pin to open the tray it's quite difficult to introduce it but uh, this is a good thing because uh, this phone uh, it's a triple has triple protection water dust and shock proof so on the back uh, on the on the bottom it has the microphone uh, it is over here then it has one moment it's quite difficult to show it to you cannot take it out no it's from this side I think 
is it? It's very difficult to take it out. Well, anyway, uh, it has a, a microphone. Uh, it has a, a jack and the micro USB port on the right side it has the fingerprint sensor the power button which it uh, looks quite cute and nice it has a red color in the middle and volume up and down uh, nothing else uh, in this side and in the back it has it's a triple camera setup with a flash at the bottom it, it's the yeah it I don't know if it's dual speaker or just one speaker cannot say and it also has for hook so that when you go outside you just uh, hook it like this something something like this going outdoor all right um, so it has uh, it's a has basic apps that standard Android which is what I like I don't want uh, too many apps in my phone useless ones uh, as I mentioned in other videos I do not really like it as long as it occupy my memory and beside I don't use them so just a basic uh, probably uh, some of them I will also delete them but it doesn't bother me yeah all right uh, so let's see the camera so yeah, the camera has you can see it over here I'll try to take a photo okay so so this is my hand I don't know if you can see it but now let's take another photo uh, going on well it seems it takes photo without me pressing any buttons oh okay uh, all right so it looks like if you uh, if, let's make it like this so that you can see it so if I press the here it's automatically making photos interesting where is it yeah well it's nice but i think it's also when you're holding the phone it's a little bit annoying i would prefer a specialized button maybe here or something i don't know but not also I mean, it, it doesn't really bother me. But, uh, let's see how the photos look like. So, one of the photos. Okay, got it. Mm. Maybe this one. Hmm, makes pretty nice photos actually. Now, uh, what else? 
so this one has also for night it seems it has night mode the video which I think has other options let's see what options it has mm, it's just very basic okay so video quality it says here medium high and fine all right okay so fine it's 1080p if you see it over here so if we press here i think yeah so high it's 720p and uh, medium it's 480p okay anti-bending hmm. so it is 50 hertz and 60 hertz but uh, usually it's made it uh, it seems that it has been left an auto okay mm, what else a geo tagging fingerprint oh okay so you can actually take out this fingerprint if you don't want to click on it and you want to click on it on camera yeah it's uh, quite annoying uh, you know if you, you can accidentally press uh, photo shooting with uh, the fingerprint so better take it out also has uh, the the sound doesn't bother me like other phones actually it uh, sounds more interesting so yeah it's uh, it's all right okay yeah very basic uh, settings not uh, really impressive so it has face beauty photo has slow motion which uh, my wife really loves that especially when she's cooking something uh, panorama and group selfie I think this one is great if I make let's say like this one photo two okay it doesn't uh, really make it uh, probably because it, it, it cannot find other people in the background so if you make it by yourself it, it doesn't really actually map so panorama yeah okay what else uh, let's see so if i make a photo like this let me see if it focuses by itself okay i'm focusing by myself and took one photo so let's see the distance is not very high the luminosity uh, it's like medium and if you can see here the it makes pretty sharp photos there is no wonder as 40 megapixel the main camera so yeah very sharp photos i will uh, test it uh, later outside and maybe i can uh, post another video i don't know if it's, i will see if i have uh, enough time so yeah and also if you can see uh, you okitel uh, probably like uh, some of the chinese companies that are doing it right now uh, they put here with uh, a sign their own signature like uh, what, what is it uh, okitel ai artificial intelligence camera shot on wp6 so yeah 
it's a uh, nice I guess I don't know uh, depends on how people like it I like it uh, it's also advertised their uh, company right when you're posting for example in Facebook and people were asking oh, how did you took that photo and so on and so they will see it's a WP6 from Okitel. All right, uh, let's see a video. <coughs> I'm sorry. So let's start a video over here. And this is the Okitel K10,000 Max. I had with code for two years now. And here it's not a dent because the screen doesn't break but it's the screen protection all right so let's stop it and let's put it on for you to see Okitel K10,000 Max. I had it for two years now. And here it's not a dent because the screen doesn't break. But it's the screen protection. Alright, so let's. Yeah, uh, the photo. Yes. Like this the photo seems to uh, the video and the photo uh, seems to be quite good they also focusing um, relatively fast uh, the I, I like the sound it has uh, it has way better sound than k10,000 max uh, well as you know K10,000 Max, it's a quite old phone. Let's put it like this. So that you can compare the, the dimensions of the WP6. It's a little bit higher. Yeah, it has like, uh, let's say, uh, five millimeters more and we put it like this yeah you see here it's two millimeters narrow but um, the screen ratio well the screen ratio is uh, different This one, I think it's uh, 16 by 9, uh, but has a 6.3 inch total uh, diagonal. This one 5.5. So, like this, if we put it, well, it's actually. It has the same wide. Oh, interesting. Yeah. Make it like this. But this one, of course, has longer screen. Like if you put it this way. Yeah. That's it. Okay, all contacts. I don't know what is that. Okay, fine, whatever. Okay, so uh, yeah, the the differences uh, between uh, WP6 and K10,000, as I said previously said, 
K10,000 has a dedicated button for photo shooting. I can make up to 40. Oops, too many. Yeah, so if you press long longer here, you can make up to 40 photos. But if you press like, let's say, this one. All right, it takes just single shots. Uh, has a worse camera, this one, of course. I think it was, um, don't quite recall, 12 megapixel or something? Yeah, or 16 megapixel, something like that. But uh, yeah, the WP6 has definitely higher and also more cameras. Uh, if you see it over here, has a small, uh, let me see if I can put it like this, small tent, uh, maybe can focus. I don't know if I can focus properly. Well, anyway, it has a like one or two millimeter dent over there, and so that it will uh, protect the cameras. But yeah, I think it will be okay. I think the uh, it, they will resist. Well, uh, the it has a metal frame. And plastic on uh, at the top and the bottom, and also plastic on the edge. Um, yeah, plastic over here. I do not know if this one it's plastic or metal, but it looks pretty nice actually. Um, yeah. I think this one it's metal too, but cannot say if it's metal or plastic. Yeah. Anyway, uh, yeah. Also here it has the uh, speaker. Uh, let me see. Let me check. Uh, let me check if I. If I can hear anything here on this speaker, let's put some music. Eight ball pool with over 10 million daily players on your smartphone or tablet. Okay, so it's only in the back, and it's only over here. That's okay, advertising. But it's good for YouTube. This this way uh, people are paid. So yeah, can totally complain about that. Uh, the sound it's uh, much more higher than two ten thousand. And has a little bit of bass. I feel uh, the vibration of the bass, and uh, it sounds very interesting. Uh, so, the K10,000, yeah, it's definitely compared to this one, it's not that nice. No bass at all. Let's compare. Let's put the. Okay, so it it looks like that K10,000 have uh, higher decibels than 
WP6. But WP6 has higher base than K10,000 Max. So. Oh, it wasn't so. Okay. Wait a minute. Is it maxing? Yeah. Okay, so definitely this is the winner. It, um, this one, I, I didn't put it at maximum uh, volume. So WP6, it's beating the K10,000 Max by far. But better sound quality and better decibels. All right. Um, what else can you say about this? Hmm. Not so many, uh, no. turn on sync. Okay, fine. So let's try to connect to something here. Yahoo, let's see how fast it is. Oh. Okay, not that fast, it seems, or maybe because it was processing, transferring the, uh, let's try something else, let's try MBL, okay, uh, actually, if you go, uh, if you go to search for uh, some newspaper, uh, here in Iceland, this MBL it's uh, very famous and it's connected extremely fast. Like, actually, I'm surprised that it is that fast. <laughs> so, like, pressing and that's it, we're connected. Okay, uh, browsing it's very, very good. Um, what else? Uh, let's put Dacia Punt Raw. Let's like that. Bank immediately, like, probably not even. <laughs> I think it also has 5G, if I'm not mistaken. Uh, it can connect in uh, uh, with 5G. But uh, there is no 5G in Iceland, not yet. So we have to, I, I'm relying only on Wi-Fi, as you can see it over here. Yes. Yeah, very interesting phone. One of I totally recommend it. Uh, if you go in outdoor, you just need this phone and nothing else. You don't even need. A professional camera it uh, well if you want to edit you can't edit because this is not the purpose of the phone but I mean you can make pretty nice photos with it yeah it uh, has an awesome camera uh, and that's it. Also, very high battery life. So if you make a lot of photos, this one can last whole day, probably half of the day, or, or maybe two days. Who knows? If you make constant photos or and videos. So yeah. So that's it, friends. Uh, this was the Alcatel WP6. If you have any other questions, please uh, let me know down in the comments. I will try to answer them uh, as much as I can. Uh, if I did not include something in this video, please let me know. Uh, and uh, if you want more content, uh, please uh, subscribe to my channel. Uh, it will help me tremendous and to continue with more of the reviews uh, please 
give like to this video if you like it if not then it's fine uh, please share it also with your friends and thank you have a nice day